Hi, and hey there, small town America. So here we are, the historic Cowtown Coliseum, opened in 1908. Here it is, 2023, and we're getting ready for the second annual cattle battle. 70 of the top youth bull riders are coming right here to compete today for one of the richest days in bull riding. You don't want to miss it. You want to get down here. Anytime you have a chance to come down to the Cowtown Coliseum right here in the historic stockyard, come in and see. See all the Hall of Fame uh, awards. See, see everything that's set up. 1908, 2023, still going strong. Get in the truck, small town America. Join me, Bob Tolman, and 70 of the best youth bull riders in America for the $50,000 Cowtown Cattle Battle, Friday, November 24th at the Cowtown Coliseum. It's the richest day in youth bull riding. The action starts at 9 a.m. with the championship round at 1 p.m. The Cowtown Cattle Battle, presented by Ava Electric and the Run and Be Rodeo Company. Get your tickets today at CowtownColiseum.com or the Coliseum box office. All right, so uh, wake up calls. Yeah, we're calling my back pin help to see if they're here. Uh, hey, where you at? Oh, shit, man. Well, come on. Okay. 
Alright, well we're, we're doing wake up calls here on uh, Small Town America, trying to get you up. Justin Hutchin, Wayne Keppel, time to get out of bed, time to get to work, boys. Hey, what is going on this morning? We, everybody just had turkey yesterday, and now you were bringing out 70 of the best riders. Well, I guess everybody thought they needed to eat some turkey before they come and got on some of these bulls today. Uh, so you got 75 of the top riders in the youth division. Uh, calf riding, junior steer riding, senior riding, and uh, 1,700 bulls. Right, well, uh, this is the second year to do this. How did this all get kicked off? Me and, uh, me and Mr. Barry, David Barry, and CJ Polito and all of us put our heads together and we're like, hey, let's do a bull riding after Thanksgiving. So last year we put it together. Uh, we just kind of had some people sponsor us, give us some money, threw it together. It was a good event last year. And we're like, hey, let's do it again. Let's see if we can get more money. Uh, this year we're paying out over about, about $50,000 what the payout's going to be to these youth. Um, I want, for one division, just kind of break it down. If he wins both rounds and the average, the kid's gonna walk away with almost six thousand dollars. That's one of the richest days of payout, just in one day. In, of a, in a one-day youth event, richest payout one-day youth event like this in a, in a sport of bull riding. Right, and then you're here at the historic Coliseum. You yes, got, sir. You got the legendary Bob Tolman's the yes, boys. Yes, sir. Yeah, man, yep. this is one of the this, events. Oh yeah, no, we set it up to be be good, you know, and I hope everything works out and everything goes right. Uh, these kids better be ready to ride because we got some of the best stock going around for the youth division. So they better come and nod in their head. If they're hungry for some money, they're gonna. this can be some good watching. Y'all tune in on the uh, Cowboy Channel Plus app if you're around. Uh, if you're not, if you're down around here, come down here. I believe the tickets are $17. Uh, if you buy one for the morning performance, uh, it'll cover you for the second performance as well. All right, guys, you know our motto, get in the truck. See y'all down the road. All right, hey there, Small Town America. Here we are, second annual. Two in a row. Yeah. Cowtown, Cowtown. How'd you do last year? Uh, I actually won it last year on a two head. I tied and then I had a ride off with one of my buddies and I ended up winning the ride off. So, I won a awesome. pretty good chunk of change last year. Right, and the money's even higher this year. Way so higher, yeah. Under that. What makes this event so special to do? I mean, you had a bunch of turkey yesterday and then you had yeah. to go up here and ride some bulls this morning. Definitely. It's just awesome. You know, it's an invitational. so. You know pretty much all the bulls and all the guys that are here and I mean kids come from everywhere, Mexico and all over the US and you know some of my buddies like one of my good buddies lives in North Carolina. We don't see him very much but he's here so it's just good that all our buddies can just come together and ride bulls and hang out. Cool. What, what, what's it mean to be here just to get invited to this today? Man it means a lot. You know there ain't a whole lot of youth rodeos with $50,000 added you know so you know it's just cool to get the opportunity to come out here. All right, guys, you know our motto, get in the truck, get down here to the Cowtown Cattle Battle. Uh, I have number three and number 14 at PKs. All right, what do you think your score? I don't know, I haven't talked to the guy yet. Riding bulls and bunch of bulls. Whatever they judge me.
symbol of our great nation, the stars and stripes that embody the very essence of freedom and unity, our American flag. The colors of old glory, the red, the white, and the blue, represent the bloodshed for liberty, the purity of our aspirations, and the vast skies of opportunity that know no boundaries. In this arena, we pay tribute to those brave men and women who have defended the stars and stripes with unwavering devotion. From the battlefields of yesteryear to the present, their sacrifices echo through the ages, reminding us that we are one nation, indivisible. So, my fellow patriots, let us stand tall and united, hats removed out of respect, hand over heart, as we proudly present the symbol of our shared dreams and aspirations. Let us celebrate the stars and stripes with unyielding pride, for it represents the land of the free and the home of the brave, these United States of America. May God bless our rodeo, our beloved Fort Worth, and this extraordinary nation that we call home. Please join with our friends and partners in American Hat Company and welcome into this arena the one symbol that celebrates the beauty, the grandeur, and the drama of the greatest nation on the face of this earth, our very own Old Glory. Please join me in prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, as we gather here in this arena, we lift our hearts in gratitude for the countless blessings you have bestowed upon us. We thank you for the freedom you have given us to gather together for an event such as this. We thank you for the thrill of competition and the excitement it brings. We humbly ask for your guidance and protection throughout this event. Bless the athletes with strength and courage, the spectators with joy and camaraderie, and the livestock with safety and care. May your divine presence surround us, reminding us of your unwavering love and grace. Keep us safe from harm's way, and grant us a memorable event filled with joy and excitement. In your precious Son's name, Jesus, we pray. Amen.
All right, hey, Cody, so made it past round one. We're headed to round two. Yes, sir. Had a pretty successful morning. Oh, yeah. 77 kids. We did it in two hours and five minutes. Sweet. What can we expect for round two? A lot of action, a lot of good bull riding. These kids are riding for a lot of money. I mean, they better come come riding. I mean, I think they rode three calves. They rode 10 or 11 steers. Uh, the senior riding, I think they rode two. And the bull riding, I think they rode two. So those kids are going to walk away with a lot of money just in the first round. So right. we'll see what happens this round, see how much money they can go home with. All right, get in the truck, small town America. All right, hey there, guys. How'd y'all do this morning? I didn't do that good. At all. All right, Se second round, we're going to do better, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay. I all got right. a little spot bubble in the back. Okay, where can people find you? Uh, Facebook, Instagram. That's about it. What's your name? What's your handle? All your good stuff, man. <laughs> My name's Caden Aguilar. Uh, Facebook would be Cowboy Caden. Instagram would be Mr. Cowboy Caden. So. Yeah. You go. Sweet. Looking for sponsors. All that good stuff, right? Oh yeah, definitely. All right, guys. Look him up. He's gonna do better on round two. All right. Trying to win this thing. All right. Oh, 
work to do work to keep the bulls off of our riders from after it happens. Gotta keep them safe. Alright, so ready for the head nod. Mateo Composto, Houston, Texas. No score in the first round this morning in the 9 o'clock round. We're ready as we're working our way to try to get to the average. Could a guy win one? Could a guy place on one? Yes. Oh, Houston down. Harris County. That is a tough place to be right inside that bucket shoot. If you want to be a contender, that's where it's all going to start. It's got to be right from step number one. Here's your game. Here's your third. Takes a hard step to the left, back to the right, and uh, steers with a step on right there, but he's going to walk away with his thumb.
That young kid has got it together. Got it together. You know, when you move up in uh, to this last right here, we're no longer riding for six seconds like we were in the other events, the junior events. Now we're going to ride for eight seconds. And his bull runs up 
comes in loose. So, on to the next one. All right, you get this. Away we go. Landed on it hard, elbow leads to the knee. He says he wants a little Yeah, now okay. Woo! Rip the rope. Yeah, what are you doing with your right foot? And a boy, get it back for a little. She
You watch the replay. This boat got the big first jump. Second jump a little higher. Gives the guy a chance to think about, oh my God, where am I going? Right there. Big high little upper got a lot of, a lot of bounce to it. All right, hey, hey Colt. Stock was a little rough today, wasn't it? Yeah, shoot, it was. They were bucking, but I mean, it's the most even better boys you can ask for. You know, that's just how it goes. Well, you know, we, we we were talking with everybody. This is kind of what everybody wants: is to bring the best of the best. The, the best. We have 12 different states here. We have five five from the team Mexico here. The best of the best. The best stock in one place for the biggest payout. It was the best version of the best for sure. I mean, shoot, that was all you could ask for. The best kids around, the best stock around. I mean, the stock won today, I'd say, but you know, all that does is make us better and come back next year to there win. You, there you go, just makes it hungry for more. You bet. All right, guys, get in the truck. Like a rock. Waiting for the score. 
Uh, no, I, I think I made money, but I didn't make a good score. All right. Good luck, man. Thank you. Great job. Hey there, small town America. You know we've watched this guy all day long. Hey, man, tell everybody who you are. So I'm Kevin Mikiff. I'm the. Um, I used to be called the Voice of Us Radio Clown. I've been Radio Clown for eight years now. Started when I was three, right here in the Cowtown Coliseum. I know, man, and you were all night long, but you're out there getting the crowd pumped up. What made you want to do that? Uh, so I met a radio clown, uh -huh. and I saw that he was having fun, so I wanted to have fun. Right, right. Well, you know, I usually wear all the red, white, and blue, and I didn't do it today, so I'm glad you jumped in there and took care of all of that. Is that your colors? Is that what um, you do? Yes, sir. Every Friday and Saturday night, I'm here in the Cowtown Coliseum every every year, all year round. Cool. And if people want to follow you, where, all, where, where can they go? Do you got a Facebook um, and all of that? You can go to Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, um, all those, and just go to Kevin McKiff, the Radio Clown, and it will go. All right, Small Town America. Go over there, like, share, follow, get in the truck. Alright, so how do you think David and them did? I think it's so I think it's good. <laughs> I, it Don't put them up. I thought this was a good day, good bull ride, and the kids tried, they won, they got their money, and hey, can't can't can't, can't ever can't ever put nothing down when you no, put that kind of money up for some kids. We put, right. we put a lot of time and money in this. You know, it's a good deal. That's what we talk about. It. You we bet. Want bring, we want to you bring bet. the best in the world hey, here. Absolutely. We 12 when states, five kids from 100%. Mexico. percent And when, I, I, when you got a, a, a sport that's dying out, you got to bring the sport to the kids, and the kids got to come, and they showed up. They Parents showed up. Showed up the they stock, back. The stock and you got to continue. Letting them get on stuff that they can ride and stuff that they can have and stuff that they can we get just, covered. We, we just it's need not about bucking them off. It's about pleasing a crowd. It's about doing it. Hey, this was 100% the best bull riding, the best youth bull riding the best youth that there's ever been. It's great. I'm just glad to be part of it. You bet. Me as well. You. All right, hey, Cody, man. What an awesome event. Man. Oh, yeah. You, you, you had it done getting all, all ready to pay out everybody. And I think that's, we've had some interviews with some of these guys here and they're talking about this has been one of the best days for youth bull riding yes, sir. that they've ever been to. Oh, yeah. how, how, how do you how do you feel at the second year pulling well, it off? I just, I mean, I, I thought it went really well. I mean, I'm tired, we're out, going 90 miles an hour right now, just trying to get stuff out so they can get ready for the rodeo tonight. But I thought it went good. I mean, we run 70 something plus, almost 80 kids, both rounds of re-rides, a little under two hours. I mean, kids rode good. I mean, bulls were good. The steers were good. The calves were good. I mean, there was just a lot of money to be had here today. Um, if, maybe, maybe next year we can get you invited. I mean, you know, as my my slogan says, you can't please them all. Well, you, uh, you know, but there's one of the things we talked about. Not only is it the historical, the biggest payout in one day for youth bull riding, but you hear a lot of people saying this is what they wanted to be the best in the world. You had oh, yeah. kids from 12 different states. Oh, yeah. Good five, job, five, five, Good there job. you go. This is the guy right here. Yeah, no, so we today, were just no, talking. Barry, one of my this, partners, in on this deal. Well, this guy put uh, it on. Well, we were no, just we talking about. He ran a little long on the on the second go. Well, we didn't start till one twelve. Well, he had a couple of rewrides. He had a couple yeah, of rewrides. But that, it, that did. it went but, good. But this is the deal. People have been talking oh, yeah. about. You want to see the best in the world come and compete. Oh yeah. You had you had kids from twelve different states. You had a team of five from Mexico. Right. The biggest yeah. payout in youth bull riding. Oh yeah. In one in one day, I mean, it's I mean, it's I don't know, I don't know what to even say. I mean, I hope next year, as we can get out there and get some followers, and you know, hey, if you want to feel like you want to sponsor, put your name out there, your business, if you just want to put your name out there, hey, anything helps, and it all goes back towards these kids. We don't put anything in our pocket. Matter of fact, we got to pay out of our pocket to pay some of the guys sometimes, so we can make it work right. So. If y'all feel like you want to do it, we're going to do it again next year. We're going to make it an annual deal every every year, every Friday. Possibly next year we're going to do it on a Saturday, though, to give a day of travel where everybody can be at Thanksgiving at home and then travel on Friday to get here and then rodeo on all day Saturday. So y'all be on the lookout. And, again, it's invitation only. And, again, can't please them all. All right, guys, you know our motto, get in the truck. This is the one that's going to start it off right here. See you down the road. Gas it up.